what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back it's your boy terabyte reacts here and we are back with another Q reaction man i think this is the final episode of the season i'm not sure but i'm jumping in um got a free day <laughs> but anyways guys um we already know what's going on man we're in the final set down to the basically the final point and i want to see how they wrap this up I said, man, second half of the season, um, it's not the greatest <laughs> in Haikyuu history, of course, but it is very interesting and entertaining, to say the least, and I'm loving it, okay? So, um, let's jump in, and I will see you guys for the review. You know, I know y'all think I probably, you know, I know y'all probably in the back of your head when you watch my reaction, you probably think I don't like Haikyuu. Um, based on, you know, you know, past maybe two or three um, episodes. <clears throat> I don't know. But I just want you guys to know that I really, really do love Haikyuu. I just didn't like the animation that was going on and it, it was kind of jarring to see and the, the thing about it is this like <clears throat> standards are important in any in any industry and I'm not saying as I said we can let it pass because we know COVID and all this stuff is preventing certain things but then you have the people who are saying that they went back to the hard style of the manga and I'm like but why though you get what I'm saying? That that doesn't make sense. That's not. It, it doesn't make sense. It's just to me, it's just bad animation. And as I said, <clears throat> um, overall, it was an awesome season. You get what I'm saying? It's just that the animation was, you know, kind of meh. You know. So this episode that we just watched, finally, we have beaten this team. Karasuno came out on top it was hard fought that last point was really good and then to have um Tsukishima <clears throat> narrate the end of it was perfect of the contrast between you know what I'm saying they used to do that crazy quick crazy fast minus tempo quick and for Kageyama and Hinata to be the ones that stop it and block it, it is absolute perfection because they know what it's like to, to you know, absolutely be using speed and understanding that it's not invincible. It is not something that cannot be stopped. You know what I'm saying? So that explanation was perfect. The music for this episode was perfect. Um, it really does. I don't know, but a, a lot of times, you know, it's the guy this, it's the same guy that creates the My Hero Academia um, OSTs, as you guys have told me. It's the same dude because I noticed it back. I think it was like in season one of IQ. I was like, these OSTs sounds a lot like the My Hero um, OSTs because you have those those specific horns. Those specific horns that you hear is is what always gets me. Is those you know what I'm saying? It's not many people. That really throws those kind of orchestral, you know, um, it's orchestral um, beats where you have these uh, these horns and y you know what I mean, where, where you can kind of fit it in with per um, with percussion like rock percussion with orchestral music. It's a perfect blend. So it's very unique. It's very unique. I mean, not unique. Un <laughs> unique to this composer and you know i really like it i really really do like it so other than that the i mean they they basically what well, it was back and forth you know um they'll take the lead karasuna will take the lead um it was important for karasuna to win this match it was very important for them because the thing about it is this, like, you know, with the twins being, you know, rated as, you know, the top, they're like top setter, 
his tw twin is no different from him and 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 the thing about it is this is is, is just like um you know we can go on and on and who's better of the twin but i think they have equal skill because they match up with each other perfectly you know what i'm saying yes they made the occasional mistake um and they basically try to move and mastered it during the match that's absolute ridiculousness you know what i'm saying the minus tempo quick that they've been doing which is the monster quick that that um kageyama and hinata started out with mind you they were doing it not blind but they basically tried it and mastered it i would say they mastered it because they did it multiple times with success you know what i'm saying um and it was perfect for hinata and kageyama to block that because they kind of knew it was coming because um and it seems like they kind of knew it was going to be low too, like right above the net. So it was perfect. You know what I'm saying? So they did a really good job this season. I don't think, I think there's, as they said, there's going to be a, an episode 25. So we're definitely going to be checking that out. And it's called The Promised Land. So I don't know if this is the, fi if this is the, the finals of the Nationals that they're go into next i don't know who their next opponent is going to be um there's plenty of teams left in the tournament we got um of course we got nekoma we got um the team that the bird eye dude is on they're still in it um we still have um what's his name uh is it bokuto i think it's bokuto i think it's bokuto is his name um, we, his team is still in the tournament. So there's plenty of teams left in the tournament. So I don't think they're in the finals yet. I think maybe this is the semis they're going to after this because they've only played what two matches. I think this is, this was the second match, um, that they played in the national so far. So we'll see how it goes. Anyways, guys, this is all I have to say, man. I appreciate you guys for coming through. We got one more episode to go. Um, and I'm trying to do these as soon as they come out now, like today's Saturday came out yesterday. Um, so I'm gonna try to be on it next week, Saturday again, as long as I can remember. Okay. So thank you guys so much. Appreciate you guys, man. Just leave a like on the video, leave a comment in the comment section. I'm really enjoying Haikyuu, man. You know, I guess I've gotten used to the animation, so it doesn't bother me as much anymore, but they definitely, definitely showed up and show for it for this fourth season except for the animation everything else was done perfectly in my opinion the, the the osts were were good some of them i didn't really vibe with a couple of them that was i think there was a couple new ones that i didn't vibe with that they were trying to do but it didn't work out but they brought back the og you know what i'm saying they brought back some of the ogs so i really do like that um especially for this episode um so it, it, it was good it was good so let's see how they wrap it up and then we'll look forward to season five of course um to see where it goes from there appreciate you guys see you guys later it's your boy terabyte reacts peace see you guys next week <laughs>